I'll never forget the text message that you sent him because he kept at him and Rich kept asking, is Steph okay? And, and for people who watch this, you gotta understand before like- Before he signed. Before he signed, before he signed. And I, it blew me away even. And, and because not uncommon for a star to feel like this is, I'm not sharing this with another star. Not, not a crazy, and not judgmental. Like if yeah. the star is like, look, this guy's at my level, and some say more, some say less, but he's at my level. This is my, like he's gonna take away from me. Mm -hmm. which, which a lot of people, players may or may not say, or they certainly say privately, I've heard, hey, no, no, that's too much. You went, you went way the other way, because even talking to him and when, after July 1st, and we were talking to him and he was trying to decide and Rich, they kept asking me that one question. What does Steph think? What is Steph? Because mm -hmm. you know Draymond was Draymond's a different recruiter. Yeah, <laughs> You're a more subtle guy, and so you weren't hitting him all the time. But you sent that one message, and somebody sent it to me, and I could not believe the uh, authenticity of it and the words you chose to use. Even me knowing who you were, I was kind of like, "Wow, that that is." You remember that? I do. Um... Everything you just explained worked because I know myself, right? I know how I could operate in that environment with somebody as great of a basketball player, <clears throat> great of a basketball player he is, all the off court, you know, platform and yeah. selling shoes and all mm -hmm. the other stuff. Like that all mattered. But I also know myself to know like I can exist in a situation where um I know when to get out the way, I know when to lead, I know when to speak, I know, you know, how to find value in myself every single day and nobody was really going to threaten that part it was just like is this going to help us win and am i going to enjoy yeah. playing basketball with him hell yeah. yeah so like yeah trying to explain all that to him and in, in that and moment. for him to trust that 100 because he didn't know you didn't you weren't we played together yeah, on team usa stuff and you know um played against each other and you know that but never spent time where you know yeah. when i send it I, I sent it as I hope to your point. Yeah, I hope he uh, you know believes it. You know, knows it's yeah. coming from an honest standpoint. And he could check with anybody around us. Like you know, is he really like that? Yeah. And, you know, they would give him you know give me that standard yeah. of validation and all that. But I it always comes out like and even like to your point. Even if you know yourself and you know you can't exist there, that's not the wrong answer. It's just, no, no, that's my point. Yeah, <laughs> but, but but you had to check. I don't know if you even had to, but a lot of people would sit for a moment and say. Am I really okay with like yeah. I, I don't know if it was audit if you're just like, yep, you know, or you No, I had to say yeah, yeah, things sit there and go, okay. The message uh, the line I remember was whether you're MVP or I'm MVP, if, if it's yours, I'll be sitting there in the front row to like for congratulating you. And I was kind of, I had this moment like, wow, that could actually happen. Like Kevin could have been MVP. Oh, he was fine as a